Hello, pirate legends. Before I start the video, I will explain how to set everything up. Today, I will be showing you how players are cheesing the PvP faction system for easy rep, or simply landing two pirates on the same server but in different boats. I know of two pirates who have used this method to obtain both golden curses. To be honest, neither one of them can hold their own in a battle though, and one is in heavy denial. However, no names will be mentioned. To farm this cheese, you will need two Xbox consoles. Both consoles will need their settings to be set on Xbox players with controllers only. This will not work on PC because there are too many servers. By choosing Xbox players with controllers only, you are dramatically increasing the likelihood of matching up with your other pirate. The two Xbox consoles also need to be on the same stamp. If you are in the same house, it will almost always be on the same stamp. However, if you need help putting them both on the same stamp, you can do this easy trick. If you're trying this with a friend or someone who has an Xbox on another stamp, use this method to get both systems on the same stamp. Have one pirate start a session, then have him invite the other pirate. Once the other pirate loads in, have the original pirate leave and start another session. They should both be on the same stamp now. To verify if they are on the same stamp or not, just look at the matchmaking times on the table. If the matchmaking times are the same for both factions, then you are on the same stamp. If not, try again. Once both pirates are on the same stamp, sail your boats away from the outpost and try to have the ships dive underwater at the exact same time. Please note that you will have better results on stamps with the longest waiting times. Brigantines and galleons will work the best as they are used less frequently than sloops. Now that you have managed to set everything up, how you proceed is up to you. Some people use these strategies to create massive wind streaks, resulting in millions of gold and tons of rep. Others will use it to practice TDM. I am not sure if you can be banned for this. I don't think it is an exploit, as you really have little control over how they choose the matchmaking. But I did use alternate accounts just in case. Thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. I will be at work all day, but I will try to answer them as promptly as possible. If you liked the video, please click like. If you would like to see more Sea of Thieves how-to videos, then please click subscribe. And if I just made your day, feel free to give me a super thanks, whatever the heck that is. But most importantly, love life and enjoy yourself. Cheers!